What the? What are you doing in my house? Oh, right, right. Real quick, before the video, I actually had a, a message that I wanted to uh, relay to you, and I didn't have any gaming footage to really put my voice over. So, in a rare turn of events, I'm actually recording my face for a video. It, maybe in the future that could be a, a new staple. But anyway, um, with recent events that have happened with me, with uh, YouTube being disingenuous and uh, saying that I've broken community guidelines without providing any instances of my content actually doing that, and when I questioned them about it, they said the same thing, saying, oh, we don't have any info or any like proof of you doing this, but, you, but it happened, our automated system saying so, so that's how it is. So, what I've done is I've started a Patreon. It's nothing important, it's completely optional, just, you know, what you feel, if you want to donate what you feel that the channel's worth with the content that it gives, if you feel that it's worth anything. The one tier that I have for the donations just says thank you. There's nothing tied to it, I'm still going to be doing the same thing that I've always been doing, because even before this I was doing it completely just for fun, and that's not really going to change. Although, in the future, I am looking maybe to do more community-related stuff, like playing games with others. I obviously can't do it for this game here with other people, just because it's... If you want to be able to play with someone, you can't... You either can't use hacks, or they have to have the same exact hacks, but... For stuff in the future, like, I've gotten a Switch, I have no games for it yet, but... Uh, there was just other stuff that I thought would be fun to play with other people, maybe feature them in videos as well, especially since I have more people watching, you know, more subscribers, more viewers, others who might want to play with me with some games and be featured in them. And uh, a lot of that could also go towards capture cards for that stuff, because the only thing I can actually record is the PlayStation 4, but maybe sometime in the future I could do that for the Wii U, especially the Wii, like I say in the video. And I have no idea if the Switch has recording on its own. If it does, that's awesome. I haven't actually gotten it fired up yet. In fact, I think I might have to look up a video on how the thing's supposed to be set up because it is the weirdest looking console. Anyway, that's all I wanted to say, so enjoy the video. And I know I say this at the end of the video in my little normal textile speech because it's easier to add that stuff in post than it is to record stuff like this in advance, or in this case in post. But everything that happens in this video happens for a very specific reason, and my little lovable turd of a nephew knows exactly what that reason is.